So in this video, I want to show you how to install and configure WooCommerce. Now, WooCommerce is a plugin that sits on top of the WordPress software. A plugin um, is written by a different company than WordPress, and it's used to add functionality to the WordPress blog. WooCommerce is an e-commerce platform that you can use to sell things using WordPress. So what we want to do is just go to plugins and um, we want to add a new plugin and we want to do a search for WooCommerce. Okay. So finish it off WooCommerce. And it's here and it says it has over a million active installs. So you just want to click this button install now. It's going to do the install automatically and then you just activate it. And that's the first part. Did you get your install done? Yes. So there's a couple things that it wants to know. It says, hey, you need to run the setup wizard. Okay. You need to do a update on your stores database to get the latest version. And it says your theme does not declare the WooCommerce support, meaning the theme I currently have does not support WooCommerce. Well, let's just go through the setup wizard, and that's the configuring part of getting the WooCommerce to work. So we're going to run through that wizard. And you can just say, let's go. And what you can see what it does, it sets up the initial page. It sets up your location, your shipping and taxes, your payments, and, and then you said it should be ready to go. So let's go. It says, um, your store needs a few essential pages. The following will be created automatically for you. Okay. So you just click continue. Okay. You pick where you are. You know, we're not in Alabama. We're going to say we're in Georgia. Um, which currency? We want the U.S. dollar. Do you want it to be in pounds or ounces? Okay. It depends on how heavy your stuff is. It's always usually better to go in ounces. Um, you know, if you're at, you can go all the way up to 16 ounces and still ship first class. So you don't want to say everything's just one pound because... Um, then you'll have to be shipping everything priority mail. Um, <clears throat> let's continue. Under shipping and taxes, yes, I'll be shipping a physical product. And yes, I'll be charging sales tax. If you charge sales tax, it's just Georgia. And they have... Um, how do you want to enter the product prices? I will enter prices inclusive of tax or exclusive of taxes. We'll just leave the default. Now we click continue. And payments, this is where um, typically you would put in your PayPal with Braintree or Stripe. We haven't talked about payments yet, but you would select that or you can do PayPal standard or take checks. For this class, we're going to just say cash on delivery because you don't have to have, um, you don't have to have anything for that. So we're going to click continue. And the store is ready to go. So technically we have... Um, we have set up and configured WooCommerce. We do not, you know, we don't need to allow them to do that. So, and then at this point, we can create our first project, which is outside the scope of this uh, this this first assignment. The first assignment was just getting you to install WooCommerce and look at WooCommerce. Now, if you're really interested in this, you should probably watch these WooCommerce videos um, and learn more about getting started and really dig down into WooCommerce because there's a lot of potential for WooCommerce.